What's up everyone? This is Frankie with Makespace.com. Today I want to show you how to download files with the box share link to your Apple device. So you can do this on an iPad or an iPhone. So the first thing you'll want to do is go to the App Store like I've done here and you want to look up a, an app called iDownloads Plus. Should have an icon like this, should be made by App Factor and um, download that application. Also, in order to use the Watchtower Libraries, you're going to need a program called iSilo. And uh, iSilo looks like this. It's going to have that logo. It's going to be by DC and Company. And you will need to have that application if you want to use the Watchtower Library files. So make sure you have both of those apps. And uh, then you want to go ahead and go to that iDownloads Plus program. And the shared link you'll type that in so you'll go to www.box.com slash meekspace so www.box.com slash meekspace and you hit the go button and it'll switch it to a mobile link if it detects you're on a mobile device which we are and uh, <clears throat> you notice here it says please enter your password on this sh for this share so you'll click here right underneath the blue box and you'll type in the password uh, that you'll get from Meekspace.com. Now this password changes once in a while so you want to make sure you log into Meekspace.com and get the proper password. Once you've entered that password make sure you click the submit button. Don't click on sign up or log in. Just hit submit. Then from there you'll have your files or in your folders. So what we're doing today is showing you how to do Watch Our Library. So you'll go into iSilo, go into your language, and you'll scroll down and find the Watch Our Library files. So that's the Watch Our Library folder. There'll be four files, and uh, you need all four of these files. So what you do is you'll pick one. It'll take you to another page and give you the option of downloading. That's what you'll want to do. You'll want to click the download link. Now, I'm not going to download it because I've already downloaded all four of them, but you want to click the download button and it'll start downloading the file for you. So, what you want to do is hit the watch our library in the blue to go back and you want to do that for all four of these files. Once you've got all four of those files, at the very bottom down here you'll click on file manager now your four files should show up over here if they're finished now if they're not finished downloading you'll you'll notice the the size of the file is climbing and it won't be a it'll kinda of be a grayed link so you wanna make sure you wait until all the files are downloaded then you wanna open each of those files up in iSilo so you'll go to the first one you'll click the little blue arrow and you'll choose open with and you'll choose iSilo so it's going to open up iSilo and open the file up. So you'll your home button, double click your home button and you can go back to a previous app that you had open. So go back to iDownloads. You want to go hit file in the top left corner and you want to go to the next file. Open with iSilo. So it opens that file up in iSilo. Again, double click your home button. Go to down iDownloads go to the files, go to the next file and open with choose iSilo. There that one is, so double click your home, iDownloads, files, and finally your last file. Open with and choose iSilo. This is the larger file, this is the full library file here. That's why it's taking a little bit longer. And once that opens up, you'll be able to uh, use the Watchtower Library on your device. It's just about that simple. Now the other thing I'm going to show you is how to get some of the other files off of the uh, box shared link as well. And you'll do them the same way, only you won't use iSilo when you choose Open With. You'll choose whatever you need to, like a PDF viewer or something of that nature.
never seen it really take this long so we're going to go into iSilo we're going to go to dock list we see our three files but we're still waiting for our fourth file to show back up there let's choose the file again open with iSilo that time it worked so that's what the full file should look like and if you hit the dock list it's going to show you the files that you have inside the inbox because doing it the way we did it, it it puts the files in the inbox if you hit the up arrow you have all your different folders and of course you can create new folders if you this top folder up here you can create new folders and you can organize things the way you want but uh, you know, most people just leave everything in the inbox because, you know, that iDownload sends them there and they'll all be grouped together. So the Watch Our Libraries is the uh, one that says full in the name. <clears throat> you just open it up and that's what it looks like. So really that's all there is to using or getting the Watch Our Library working on your iPad or your, uh, your iPhone. Now we're going to go into iDownloads again and we're going to go back to Files and then back to our browser and we left off inside of uh, the box share under watch our libraries but we're going to go and hit my theocratic files to take us back to the root and I wanted to just show you that inside of uh, iSilo and your language is a weekly study material this is where you can go to get all of the study material for the upcoming weeks at the meeting so you can be pre-studied those are very important files and you'll want to use those as well there's also the same thing in the PDF and doc format. If you go into your language, you can also get the same type of weekly study material there as well. There's a couple of different formats, but this is where you find the stuff. That basically kind of wraps up the tutorial on how to use the box share on your Apple device. I hope the tutorial helped.